Hi, I'm Evie. I study the Bachelor of Antarctic Science at the University of Tasmania and I'm currently a student in the Master of Computational Biology at the University of Melbourne. So the thing that I find most fascinating about computational biology is probably the scope of the subject. There's a lot of different areas such as uh, genomics and proteomics. My personal major interest is definitely modelling of biological systems. I think that's a really fascinating area and it lets you answer research questions in a way that just hasn't been possible before. So I decided to study the Master of Computational Biology at the University of Melbourne because I knew that I wanted my biology to have more statistics and I wanted to improve my statistical literacy and I got really interested in the idea of working with big data and computer modelling. Uh, I found a really interesting quote. It's uh, previous generations had to work with computers, but the new generations have to know how to code. So I really wanted to build that into my skill set for the future. So I chose to study computational biology at the University of Melbourne because it was the perfect degree, basically. I went to an uh, information evening for the postgraduate studies and I saw a presentation on the degree and I applied that night and it was fantastic. <laughs> So the Masters of Computational Biology at the University of Melbourne is a Masters by coursework. I'm doing the three year Masters, so I've got two years of coursework and then one year of research coursework combined. I'm in my first year at the moment, so I've had to do a few foundational subjects, which means that I'm doing some Masters level subjects and I'm also doing some second and third year undergraduate level subjects. My classes are all really varied in terms of size and how many people are in them. So I've got some lectures that are really big and some that are really small. But all of my practical tutorial workshop classes, those sorts of things, they're really quite small and individualised and you really feel like you're conversing with your tutor and getting the best activities and options that you can. What I like most about the program that I'm studying is Basically, the coursework itself. I'm really fascinated all the time in all of my classes and I'm really loving what I'm learning and I'm engaged constantly and wanting to go out and learn more independently as well as within my classes because it is just such a fascinating area. I've told people before a lot that I consider this course to be future-proofing my career because I think for biology you really need to have a good statistical literacy and particularly for all areas at the moment, coding is becoming such a, a massive part of life. And I think it's really vital that you can have those sorts of skills. So when I'm finished, I'm really not sure yet what I'm going to do, but I'm really hoping to be able to apply my skills in a research based area, whether that's in a lab or as a member of a university who's doing fieldwork research and then taking that research back to the lab and crunching the big data. I don't really know yet, but I'm pretty excited for whichever stream or path I end up on. So thanks for listening to me today. I hope what I've said has helped you form your thoughts and your ideas a little bit more or given you something new to think about. Good luck on your computational biology journey.